to Pangroove with the Archbishop of Pan, Len Bugsy Sharp's arrangement. Alex Len's music, it's Len's arrangement. A wonderful performance indeed from Face to Pangroove and just another installment of what has really been an amazing now This has been a fabulous night of music so far. <laughs> We're band number seven out of 11 and it really makes you feel great to know that you're part of a country that has produced so much great music. Let's talk about uh, what Bugsy did. I felt that everything worked tonight. I think the tempo was absolutely the right tempo for this song. They must have spent a lot of time deciding what type of conk they needed. I thought everything was palatable yet exciting. And I thought that this was a perfect conk for this tune. The intro, Bookzy has been able to capture the, the classical element of paying a tribute to Pat Bishop without losing the excitement of a panorama. And that must have been something that had to be worked on very carefully, that you don't want a song like if you're happy that she's dead, you know, that sort of a way, but at the same time that you're celebrating her life. And I thought this worked for the tune by having that classical hook, which epitomized Pat's life, and yet keeping the melody line of the tune. As we know, one of the catchphrases in tune is Pat Bishop, We'll always love you. Mm -hmm. And that was used in the introduction and used extensively throughout the arrangement, even back to the very end of the tune. And th that statement was actually the final statement that the band made. I thought that um, we used a lot of phrases from the original melody, which is one of the things I know that the judges tend to look for. Which is kind of you... like, which is kind of like what happened with, with all stars as well. They stuck. You, right to study. what is in there and, and then work developed from there, from there. Yeah. what I liked about um, this particular thing one of the things that the judges also look for too is the melodic development or mel melodic variation and Bugsy cleverly used certain lines and sort of vary those lines in between to get different effects so I thought this was very well done the middle and the background pans carry the melody a lot, giving the tenor fans more room to play.